Hey, welcome everybody. My name is Daryl and today I'm going to talk to you guys a little bit about SEO and I'm going to give you guys the entire process from start to finish on how to rank your website, where to go, who to talk to, everything that you'll possibly need in this tutorial. Now, after you watch this, you'll never, ever, ever have to buy anybody's ebook. I will show you how to do everything for free. Just watch and learn and listen and we will get there. So first off, you guys are maybe wondering, what is SEO? You guys have probably heard that term a lot of times and you guys probably don't know what it is. So basically, SEO is optimizing your website to sort of generate organic traffic. It's getting people from search engines to actually find your website. Now, they basically monitor it by keywords. And don't worry, we'll get into keywords just a little bit. We're just sort of touching base with what SEO is. Now, if you go to my website, you try to search for my website right here, Daryl Wilson, you're gonna see that my website comes ranked number one. Now, it wasn't always like that because this guy right here, there was a big legal case between a police officer who killed this young African-American man and it was a big disaster and his real name is Darren Wilson. However, people thought his name was Daryl Wilson. So I sort of had to work harder to get my website um, you know, ranked on the front page. Now, going back to this, I wanna show you guys what I mean by organic traffic. So this is a perfect example of what organic traffic is. So these right here are paid ads up here. So basically these guys are paying to be there. Once they run out of their budget, their ad disappears, they're no longer being found on the search engine. Now these right here are organic. So when somebody types in Virginia AdWords up here, these websites will show up organically. They, they don't be charged for clicks and they don't have to you know pay any AdWords. They're there organically by promoting their website with SEO. And I wanna show you guys how important SEO is. It's super important. And I'm gonna give you guys an amazing example right now. So let's go to this website right here. Best, let's just type in best web hosting. Let's, let's, let's go to that, best web hosting, right? And these right here are paid ads as you guys can see. Now I'm gonna scroll down right here and go to one of these websites. Let's go to this website. Now, just by looking at this website, this website is complete garbage, but it doesn't matter because they have good SEO practices and they're on the front page. So what do I mean by garbage? Well, first off, they just list a bunch of companies. They just lift a bunch of bars. There is no relevant information here. They're just trying to get your money through clicking on these affiliate links. That's all they're trying to do. That's all they care about. So let's just say, okay, let's just click on one of these reviews. Let's just see what they say. So right here, it just says, Pro, 90 day money back guarantee, con expensive. So this is the reason why SEO is so important. This is a garbage website, but it doesn't really matter because they're on the front page. People are gonna click on this website before they click any other website. And the reason why they're there is because they practice good SEO strategies. So this is the reason why SEO is so important. Now, there's a lot of people on YouTube that will claim, oh, watch my tutorial, I'll teach you about SEO. Guys, I'm gonna have to be honest, if you really want to learn SEO by yourself, well, first off, I'm gonna show you where you can learn it, and then I'm gonna show you where you can get it, okay? So I'm gonna go ahead and type in Daryl Wilson SEO tutorial. Now, this is a website called Udemy, and Udemy has instructors all over the world that teach about courses and SEO, YouTube, HTML, PHP, everything. Now this guy is the highest rated instructor on Udemy with over 7,000 students, guys. So this guy is in the business, he knows what he's doing, and this video is around 13.5 hours long. Now usually this course is 50 bucks, but I actually took this course maybe a few months ago, and the instructor found out I had a YouTube channel. So he said, hey, you know, can you promote it on YouTube? I said, dude, I learned a lot from you. Of course I can, I can uh, you know, promote your video. So my personal advice, guys, protect yourselves. Don't rely on anybody from YouTube. Don't rely on any ebook. Never pay for an ebook. I want to make that very clear. Those people don't care about you. They just want your money. And all of them are like all these under like qualified random kids that just claim they're some SEO experts. No, learn it from somebody in the business who owns a firm who does it for a living. So this is the best possible advice I can give to, uh, give to you uh, from one person to another. Now you can go on YouTube and keep spamming forums trying to learn it. But I mean, just learn it this way. Do it the right way. Don't try to cut corners because you're gonna learn it the wrong way and you're gonna, you know, it's just not gonna be good. Now, I'm not saying to do SEO by yourself, but what I am saying to do 
is once you learn the SEO process, guys, you guys can go to websites like Freelancer or Upwork, upwork.com or Freelancer, and you guys can actually hire your own SEO company from India. Now, I highly recommend to outsource it from India because the prices, guys, are dramatically cheaper. And how do I know that? Because I used to work for an SEO company in Los Angeles. So all we did was get clients in the state, charge them around $800, and then outsource it to these guys right here where they'll work for $5 an hour. So you guys can see the price benefits is extremely cheap, but the quality of work is amazing. So um, if you're just starting, I would definitely look into uh, hiring an SEO company from India, and they're gonna ask you something. They're gonna ask you, what kind of keywords do you want? So what is a keyword? So for example, if I type in Daryl Wilson WordPress, that is a keyword. This right here is a keyword, okay? So Daryl Wilson WordPress, that's a keyword. So my website is being found on the search engine for that. Now, they're gonna basically say, well, what keywords do you want? How do you know which ones to get? Well, you can have them do keyword research for you. Tell them, you know, I want you guys to do, you know, research to find out what's the best possible keywords. Now guys, I want to let everybody know this ahead of time. If you're trying to get a keyword called best attorneys in LA, yeah, best attorneys in LA, your website will probably never be found on the front page because this is a very, very, very competitive keyword. That means these guys are spending huge bucks trying to get their website on the front page because let's be honest, if you're on the front page right here, like bestlawyers.com, you guys probably spend a lot of money promoting their website. So I would personally, you know, recommend like one of these companies from India. Don't get too competitive with your keywords. Don't try to go crazy. Remember, you're just beginning. You're going to make a lot of mistakes. But um, I would personally just try to um, get some less competitive keywords. And this process, guys, can take anywhere between one to six months. Now, I actually have an SEO company that I personally use as well. And let me see right here, where is it? Yeah, under my store. So I have uh, two companies that I use from India and they have ranked my website on number one for many of my keywords. Now, I just wanted my name as number one. So it was a less competitive keyword. Now for, it depends on your niche, guys. If you want best car insurance in Los Angeles or best internet company in the world, those are competitive keywords. So it's gonna take longer to rank those words. In fact, they might never get ranked. It really depends on your competitors and their budget as well. You know, it's like an online auction. Everything's always, always, you know, they're, they're, they're trying to promote this company, promote that company. So remember guys, I want to just go ahead and recommend this course to everybody. Uh, I know it does cost money, but um, just do the right thing. Learn it from somebody in the business. And then from there, you can use those strategies to monitor your SEO company so you can start raking your search engine. And so you can basically know what they're doing. So you're not really in the dark, you know, because um, the worst thing is to hire a company and not know what they're doing. But if you learn the SEO practices and then you outsource it, you can sort of monitor them. And that's exactly what I do, guys. So uh, I want everyone out there to sort of protect themselves. Don't buy any eBooks. Don't go to any other website claiming they can get you on the front page in a day. Please, please, please don't do that. Just try this course. It has a 30 day money back guarantee. So this is part of my um, my uh, lecture on, on the internet marketing because internet marketing guys, it's a little complicated, you know, it's not easy and it's a whole trait, it's a whole new ballpark. So I know a lot of you guys are creating your websites and you have nowhere to go. Well, if you don't get started on this guys, your website really won't be found. So um, that's it for my tutorial guys. Um, I just wanted you guys to basically find the right direction to go to with this because I know there's a lot of different ways you can go on the internet, but um, learn it from someone in the business and then outsource it. In fact, you guys can even maybe hire this guy, you know, to do it for you, you know, whatever it takes, but um, just, I, I don't want anyone to get screwed. <laughs> you know, I don't want everyone to, to like, I paid this guy $500, he promised me this and now he's gone, right? Like, no, do it yourself. You're on your own. So remember, you need to protect yourself, okay? So that's it, guys. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys a little bit later.